I recently bought the Travis Scott Air Force Ones on StockX on December 4 after striking out on the sneakers app for the pair. I bought them for $323 ship and currently as of the end of December they're going for $400 plus. It comes in a white box. All the AF100s part of the collection come in a white box. Here are all the detachable Nike swooshes. Let me know which one you like the best. Um, I really like all of them and I really like that all of them are reflective and shiny. But I would like to know uh, which one's your favorite. The swooshes come on reinforced cardboard. One of the things I noticed, however, is that the Velcro, which attaches the swooshes to the cardboard, can come off pretty easily, so it's best to be careful. And these swooshes are for 8 to 11.5. Here is the StockX authentication card. I chose StockX because the prices were cheaper than eBay and the Goat app. Here are the shoes. It seems like there's also a purchase receipt. similar sticker here is the receipt from stock x i believe all af 100s had similar shoe tissue paper and here are the shoes one of the key features i love about the shoes are the grill inspired lace locks travis scott makes a lot of cash and he likes to splurge on grills from johnny dang there in houston this is a nice touch let me know what you guys think about this feature and there is Nike checks on the front. The lining of the canvas shoes are multicolor 3M reflective. There are metal eyelets for the laces on both shoes. Another unique feature are the detachable patches which are uniquely placed on the laces in the center have this sad face and also we have the cactus jack symbol both of them are made out of chenille and I assume they can be hand washed if needed if they get dirty I don't like how they look without the patches however I guess you can lace over the eyelets here's how they look with the chrome swoosh this is my favorite I believe they were inspired again by the South Korea AF1 mids or some Nike Cortezes that also had a chrome swoosh. Ordinary gum bottoms. Here are the medial sides. The chrome swoosh is more vulnerable to abrasions and scratches due to the shininess. The backs of the shoes have upside down Nike Air logos on the heels. The insoles read Travis and Scott. I think these shoes are packed with features and are definitely one of the top Air Force Ones of 2017. Here are the lateral sides and the swooshes come off just like this. Both lateral and medial side swooshes are detachable. Nike Air is also upside down on the tongues. There are just too many options on how you can wear this shoe. Here are another set of iridescent like swooshes. There's just too many options and the customizability of the shoes make this one of the best Air Force ones of 2017 in my opinion. Here are the flame swooshes. I would rock them like this with an upside down swoosh. Right now I only plan on wearing these 
inside, at work, however I plan to wear them every day in different ways in 2018. What was your favorite pair from the AF100 series? And also I'd like to know which are your favorite swooshes? After all, I struck out on the sneakers app so I had to pick these up from StockX. On December 4, Travis Scott was in store at Undefeated in Los Angeles for the releasing of the shoe. He also signed shoes and also met with fans. He was also wearing a green iteration of this yeah. pair. Do you think this is a future colorway of Travis Scott Air Force Ones or are these a customized pair? Let me know what you think or if you have any information. I also want to invite you to check out my high quality Balenciaga reproduction headbands I am selling on my site. We accept card payments, PayPal and Apple Pay and ship internationally. Check out this video regarding Travis Scott's Air Force Ones and his inspiration behind them. I'll link my other Air Force One videos down below. Thanks for watching.